I want to cover the Flutter IntelliJ IDEA Live Templates, but before I get to that, I want to cover the Flutter Plugin 12.0 release. So looking at the release notes, I see that the support for 2017 has been added. Then Live Templates, Stateless, Stateful, and a Widget with Animation Controller has been added. And support for specifying additional arcs to Flutter application launches. Default run configuration creation on project open when possible. Device menu improvements and miscellaneous bug fixes. So let's get started. Let's look at the live templates today in Flutter 12.0 release. So I'm going to go to the thing and look at the options here. So we have a new stateless widget a new stateful widget, and a new widget with animation controller. So let's look at that. Okay, so to get started, we I have an event down here, and it tells me I've got to update the Flutter plugin first. So I'm going to click on Update, and we see the release notes and what the plugin is doing. Okay, so let's click on Update to update the plugin. Alrighty, that was pretty easy. Let's open up the project and see what the live templates look like. So now that the project is open, let's take a look at using the live templates. So let's find lib or lib and main.dart and we'll just scroll to the top. Okay, so let's look at the live templates available. Now I'm gonna add some space and try out the three live templates. So first of all, I want to try the stateless widget. So let's type in stateless. This is a new state stateless widget. Okay, I'm going to hit enter to autocomplete and then I'll give it my name, my stateless widget. Something generic to get going here. Okay, so now I can add a container or child elements to the container. So let's go to the next the next live template. Let's see how a stateful widget looks. Stateful. If I start typing in, it suggests the options. Stateful, and I'm going to hit enter to complete. Okay, it's. let me type in my stateful widget. Okay, so that's pretty cool. It created the boilerplate for a stateful widget. Okay, there's one more cool live template and I'll scroll down. Let's just minimize the bottom here and make some more space so we can tell what we're doing. Okay, S-T-A-N-I-M is a new widget with animation controller. So I'm gonna click on this, I'll hit enter. And then let's say, let's give it a name. Oh, my menu there, my anime widget. Okay, so this is my anime widget, which is a stateful widget, and then instantiates the state, and the state has an animation controller. Okay, so that is the, those are the live templates I can use in the new release of the Flutter 12.0 plugin. Thanks for watching. Follow me for more tips and tricks, and I'll catch you later.